This is a commercial faucet with sprayer and aimed 8 inch center wall mount for commercial sinks and yes they are used a lot in restaurants and other places i love the boxing by the way is actually really nice put and yes this one has a 26 inch height with pull down pre-rinse sprayer and a 12 inch spout with thickened hose for two up to three compartment utility sinks that you have the basins two to three of them it can go for because you can extend it in all sides you have a nice installation instructions right here and since this is all metal i'm gonna use one of these things to put the parts on because this table is glass and glass breaks it is nicely packaged i have to say that absolutely beautiful packaging we just take this first compartment yes these are some of the parts and then you have a secondary compartment in this box let me just pull it out really quick and put the box away and we have all the parts right here it should be pretty straightforward to put together because they're usually really nicely uh put on the user's manual with all the parts you need and how they go together and all the numbers and all that good stuff and we're gonna do just that but we're gonna do it really quick now so let me just pull this quick just to show you the materials first yeah this is some heavy duty stuff this is this is not the, for the faint of heart and uh yes we will have the piece that you can hang but look at this uh handle here that you spray with look at that really good quality and yes this is what holds it if you want to keep it open that's like that and it is absolutely high quality material i love this look at that this is some water opening let me just put my hand here yep that's where the water comes through really beautiful and the spring oh this is some real heavy duty spring this is <laughs> this is not a joke wow and this is the input input we put this on the side wow they really did a good job with this one and this is the base with the two switches handles i really love this because it's uh marked the if i can make it focus yep it's marked here as you see that's the cold side and that will be our hot side really beautifully made and beautifully executed in this design let me put this back in here really quick we have the couplers should be here yep both of them are right here that's where these go I have one more of these rubbers somewhere yep it's right here so for example these go right here but i suggest you know the mount where you're gonna put them first put the rubber gasket in there and it goes just as it follows here it's that easy look at that boom and this one is not going anywhere and you do the same with the other side so now they're both connected and here on top we have a few things we have to install first and this is gonna be your this is the other uh washers and stoppers and gaskets and all really nice and tight right here so you have everything you need to install it with you in this box let me put them on the side really quick and yes if you need to mount the wall you have the brackets the anchors and all that stuff with an allen key and all the parts are really high quality metal none of this actually feels cheap at all by any means really really loving how they put this together so this goes in right here as you see right now then you have another piece that gets them actually to go together right here you put this on the under side just like you see here and uh it'll make sense all in a second and uh, i'm not gonna go with a parrot key or anything right now because this is just for the video that's where you open and close the water and here that's where this part goes as you see it has a really nice dual gasket to prevent any spillage you put it right there and of course you just uh, screw this in and of course you have to tighten it but i'm just gonna show you where they actually go and it's that easy so after that you have one more piece here let me put this on the side so on top if you want to put the uh, sprayer higher than for example this is it would be this high right now but if you don't want it to interfere with this one here uh you would go with one of these guys as you see these are to extend it just like you see here they'll extend it like that up to 26 inches yep 
I said it right, up to 26 inches. <laughs> that is a lot, I know, that is a lot. And now it would be the best time to put this part right here. Let me just open it up a little bit. So this is the hook, as you see here. Let me just uh, open it up just a little bit like this, and it should go in here slowly. Yep, it did, just like that, okay. So the hook or the catcher, as we call it, so you can put the sprayer on it on the side. That's the whole job of this hook. If you ever worked in a restaurant or had your own restaurant, you know exactly what this does. And it's actually one of the most useful parts of it, believe it or not. Now, this is up to you. If you want to do this part to uh, hold it on the wall, depends how far your wall is, for example, or the base, you can put this either under here or over here that is up to you you put this down slowly right here and it has an allen key right here on the side let me just put the take the allen key really quick outside and the allen key is right there as you see right here and you just tighten it to your desired point don't over tighten it because there's no need this one is just to hold it that's all it does so for example let's say this is your sink here this one goes to the wall there's another base plate right here so you put this in here and there's another allen key part here that you can tighten and then you put the two screws on the wall and as you see this will be held then you see so it doesn't tilt forward because now we're when we install the uh sprayer you'll see this gets a little bit heavy because of course the, the sprayer is not a tiny thing let me just put it on this side. <laughs> it looks like I had it the opposite this whole time, but you get the point. And the sprayer goes right here. It has a pre-installed rubber inside. Not sure if you can see it. Yep, right there. Has a pre-installed rubber. And you put it right here. And boom. Sorry, I hit the camera right there. Just like this. It is pretty much installed. Just put the wall plate so it holds. And the rest is, of course, you have the... Uh, two sides here that goes through the uh, splash plate on the back of the sink whether it's attached or detached mine is detached or the one we're gonna take a look at today but if it's detached or attached it doesn't matter as long as the holes align you put these things right here there's a rubber inside already in both sides let me just put it right here boom just like that and the other side the same yep they're good now and you have these washers, please do not forget them. They are quite important. So there's a rubber gasket right here. And you put this uh, rubber, you see it like this here, in here. And of course you go with a big washer right on top of it. Put it through the wall. And then of course you grab one of these thingies right here. And you can go through, if you want, you can add more washers here. But I didn't add all of them because this is not permanent right now. But basically the wall is right here or the uh back the splash plate and these go in and hold it as you see boom in both sides and then of course you install the water uh pipes the cold and the hot on this side and it's actually one of the easiest things to install i know to a lot of people it sounds like it's a big thing like oh commercial it is very easy and yes they can be installed in regular homes too just because it says commercial nothing stops you from installing it in your house even though i know it's for restaurants but having one of these in your house you will love your life trust me on that one you will love your life and uh, oh yeah the hook i almost forgot to show you before we install it anywhere really quick how cool this part is here let's say this is here boom let me just put it around and let's say you're done washing with a sprayer and all that look what the hook does boom it catches it on the side so now you are free to use the regular spout here and the water is right here i really love this one because you can leave it for example on uh, hot water only the whole time as you see here and then it will be hot water directly here so it just depends what you put in here first. And in my opinion, these are not only for restaurants, but you can use them for homes too. And just, it works. That's all I care and that's all I need to let you know. And this is probably the best quality I've had my hands in a long time, ever since the restaurants. So we'll go install it and uh, see it actually working. 
Why not? Okay, here it is. I just finished installing this uh, faucet. The quality, as I said, is definitely top notch on this one. This is just one of the kitchens that I installed it, uh, or one of the sinks, I should say, that I installed. And absolutely is great and easy to actually install. If you've ever done kind of handyman uh, work before, this will feel right at home. And as you see, it clears up the sink versus the old one that uh, was here, that there is no way you can just push everything towards the wall. And this one, as you see, you can turn everything towards the wall and you have the entire sink open and it goes high enough to let you grab the handle to spray actually all around. And we're going to see that just in a second. But the installation was actually done with a 90 degree elbows instead of going in the wall. Unless you have the water come into the wall, the existing plumbing, then yeah, you can just go straight to the wall. In my case, I had the plumbing coming from under on this particular sink. So I had to buy two small 90 degree elbows and install them and the water comes just from under straight to it hot and cold and i like how it's marked by the way because a lot of uh faucets these days i don't know why but they just assume that everybody knows where hot and cold is but this one i like that it's marked left is hot and right is cold and it just works and as you see here we're gonna just uh open the water and see the flow but basically it is one of those things that I would highly suggest every kitchen should have one. I know this is geared mostly for restaurants and commercial settings, and it makes a lot of sense, I know. But until you have it in your house kitchen, you wouldn't believe how useful this actually is. I am not even joking. It's extremely useful. So let me open the water here. As you see, you can just twist it all around and look at the, that flow. Literally all the flow that your house can have can come through this one without a problem. And I really love it. It's easy to use, easy to install, just makes perfect sense in the kitchen. And as you see, look, it goes on this sink side to side. And this is a huge sink. This is not a small one. I know the camera doesn't make it look that big, but really, this is a huge sink. It's one piece. And here's the sprayer. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. And you can uh, hold it, turn on like that with that latch there. And you can, I don't know, to clean uh, pots and pans and plates and whatnot. So you don't need to just hold it the whole time. And when you're done with it, you just put it there on that hook. And it stays out of your way completely. It doesn't stay hanging in front of you. And right there you see that uh, turn there is where you open the water towards either the main faucet or to the sprayer. Absolutely love it. And here you can take this part here. That's where the filter is, the plastic filter. And those are replaceable. You can find these easily everywhere. And they're quite cheap actually to replace. And you can install right there. It's a standard fitting for all those uh, filters. There's water filters that you can install actually right where I'm putting the filter back on. And you have a water filter directly right here. It's absolutely amazing because the other one I had installed on this sink did not have that uh, standard fitting, but this one does. So you can install, I'm not gonna say the names, but there's a lot of companies that make those uh, attachable or, or uh, fitted filters directly to the uh piece and here is as you see you can clear the whole sink literally you can have the whole thing and yes the sprayer you can turn it around in all sides it doesn't need to be just one place and that's where i bolted it to the wall that's the support it goes to the wall so it holds everything good even though those 290 degrees that you see right here they're strong that's uh black steel i think they call it looks rusty but it's not rusty believe me <laughs> But that's black steel, 90 degrees, because that's all I could find. But you can make them more beautiful if you want to. That's up to you. But basically, that's how both are installed directly to the existing holes that the sink had from before. And you have it super solid in the kitchen. And here's that turn that I told you that it can open water for the sprayer or the main faucet. And the sprayer, just like that. Easy to use easy to put away and it clears the whole sink and it looks really beautiful 
absolutely love the look of it because it brings that commercial value or commercial grade of a faucet in a normal kitchen or if you don't want it for your normal kitchen just buy it for your restaurant this is i guarantee you you will love it it is the standard that's used in restaurants it's made with stainless steel and not just painted on so you know it's actually good quality and here's the whole spring <laughs> looks really good actually that goes to the sprayer and you can uh, pull it as long as you want and as far as you want because there's a lot of it and on the back there at the support to the wall that you can cut to however far your wall is from the faucet in my case i just had to cut it around half so that fit perfect and worked perfect and look at that you have the whole piece installed and look at that you can put everything away just like i told you and make the whole sink free look at that you can do whatever you want now on this sink because nothing is on its way everything can be pushed away towards the wall in my opinion this is the best faucet that you can install for either a restaurant or a home and look at that from close up now really quick that i told you the standard fitting that you can install either replace the plastic filter here when you need to if you want to if you have harsh water or you can install the standard uh, filters yes there is a water filter that you can buy installs directly right there i mean it cannot get much easier and much better than this in my opinion i am i could suggest it 100 percent because it's worth it and a million thank yous for the guys to, for sending it to me because it's absolutely a great great quality